Hey, what's up? I hope you're well. Thank you so much for coming back. Guess where we are right now? At the airport! We are going to Rodrigue. It's the first time we're leaving Mauritius since Corona and I just need change. So we're going to Rodrigue. Are you excited? So excited! Let's do it! <laughs> And we are here. We have just arrived at Rodrigues. Look how happy she is. <laughs> Woo! We are at the Tecoma Boutique Hotel. Okay, we chose this hotel because it is on the beach. The water is crystal clear. There are massive wide beaches. So every morning we can just go into the sea and it's close to everything. Anyway, have a look at our room. It is amazing. And then let's get adventuring. Are you ready? I can't wait. <laughs> let's do it. I've got something I don't need to hide. Struck by Now can you see why we chose this hotel? It is on the beach, it is beautiful, and it's close to everything. And we love adventuring, so we're gonna go in the pool. Let's do it. Good morning, how are you? Okay, it is our first official day in Rodrigues. We are now going to a market. It is 7 a.m. right now. I'm super keen, I don't know what it's gonna look like. Apparently you can get heaps of cool stuff there, so I'm super keen, let's do this. What do you have there? A basket. What for? For the market. The beans of the market. <laughs> so this little one is looking for a basket to buy. And we are back from the markets. We are now going to a beach called Anse Bouteille. Apparently it is one of the most beautiful beaches in Rodrigues. Let's do it. Let's go to Anse Bouteille. We are on the way to Anse Bouteille. We're nearly there. Let's go have a look. We are done at Anse Bouteille. Phil, where are you taking us? A Trou d'Argent. <laughs> okay, we're going to a place called Trou d'Argent. I don't know how far it is, but let's keep going. Yo, what's up? It is now the same day later in the day. We are walking. I don't even know where we're going. Where are we going? <laughs> we don't know! Hello. In Rodrigues, you can literally just walk through anyone's backyard to get anywhere you want. If you see a hill you like, you're like, oh, let's go there. And we're just walking and we found a weird looking dog. Have a look at this one. <laughs> Have you ever seen a pig this size? <laughs> oh, little piggies! 
This is so cute. <laughs> One thing I've realized is there are a lot of weird looking dogs around here. Have a look at this one. And this one. Vic, where are we right now? Highest point of Rodrigues! So Phil is a local around here. He comes here so often. He knows everything there is to do. We started walking on this random trail. Basically, we're on the highest mountain of Rodrigues. It only took how long? 23. Two minutes and tw uh, 23 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> Can you tell me what is going on inside your mind? Cause you're so hard to read, it's like you're tangled in the lies. You tell me one thing, do another. Tell me where you stand. Tell me what is going on tonight. Hey, what's up? It is now the next day. We are sitting at the front of the hotel watching the sun rise. It is 5.30 a.m. right now and if you know us, if you watch these vlogs, you know that whenever we stay somewhere, we love to wake up early and go and explore. So we're just sitting here and we're waiting for the sun to rise to fly the drone. How did you sleep? Like a baby! <laughs> What do you say we go get some breakfast? Let's do it! <sighs> I'm always excited when there's food involved we're about to go have... Breakfast! Let's see what they have ready for us. What kind of a dog is that? I've never so that's seen. That's my puppy Gertrude. I've never seen a dog She's like pregnant, this. Pregnant, as you can see. What are you doing, little girl? I'm getting this rope off this little dude's paw. Hey, what's up? We are hiking. We are in a secret little spot right now. Multan Chiri and Rodrigues. He doesn't really know where we are. I don't know where we are either, but we're just hiking. We're adventuring. We are walking with no goal. We don't know where we're going to end up. We don't know if we're going to see the sunset or not. That'd be pretty cool, but Phil has other plans for us. He wants us to walk kilometers and kilometers because we just finished a tub of Nutella. So this adventure began at Phil's house. We were like, hmm, what should we do? So we just got out of the house. We started walking in this random direction. We found and these cliffs we're walking along the cliffs and I don't know where we are going to end up anyway we've been sitting here for like 20 minutes now let's keep going we are in the middle of a field we are surrounded by cows there's one right here there's another big dog right here and a few right in front of us if any one of these cows decides to run at us we are pretty much screwed oh my god oh the little baby cow Woo! We have made it back to civilization. How was your little afternoon hike? So much fun! Phil, how was your little afternoon hike? Wood! <laughs> Wood! Holy damn! Oh, we got attacked by a cow! No, this one's for you, Olivier! Olivier, she nearly got killed by a cow! Oh my god! She looks so nice, Vic was trying to just feed her and then she just charged at us. Luckily she was tied up. I mean, not lucky for her, but lucky for us because we'd be dead. Cool, so the day has come to an end. The sun has set, a cow nearly killed Vic. Anyway, we went on a nice little afternoon hike and we're walking back home now. Look how cool these colors are. Can you please tell the world how getting charged by a thousand <laughs> kilo cow feels like? It's terrifying. Oh my God. Once again, thank you so much for coming back, liking, commenting, subscribing. 
whatever way you're supporting me and thank you so much and we'll see you very very soon with some more Rodrigue's videos. Bye!